Hey man, you can know you watch. Alright, my people, my day again. Bless up on the Sunday. Big up, respect and manners. Alright, so, I have one main thing that I want to talk to you about. But, before I reach on to that topic, I'm going to present a video to you. And I want you to listen carefully to some things that a man said in this video and tell me if you agree or if you disagree with the things that the man said in this video. Look, listen and observe for yourself. Yeah man, well I, I go make Mr. Andrew Wallace know this. My pitney when he might give me trouble and me beat him, come take lick off of him. And that's why so much gun man there, and we can't control them. We are 14, 13, and 15. Can no one bring foreign to Jamaica? Where Jamaican tough head pitney them, I lick grow them. And when you was a youth, I lick grow, no make no acknowledge life up till today, dear. And for your start talk about corporal punishment, nothing in the home, them most of the pitney them at on gunman teeth. You can't talk to them at school anymore as teacher. See? And when me I go to school as a you teacher of belt, to slap pitney in them hand. And teach pitney wrong from right. And right now, no wrong from right now, teach. Because when I come in, you don't look a foreign style. Where pitney I go kill off them parents and sit down in the house till the police come. And then I go kill people pitney. I said, parents, nah, school them picnic good. When time pe picnic forget slapping at them rats when them listen, disobey. Man. Listen. And you know with your rich picnic. Me not rich, so me poor. Gary, so me born. <laughs> me have a school, my youth, big man. So try get that in your head, brother. And run the country properly. And stop going like you want to run down the country in a violence. Because that's why so much crime and violence are going on. Because nobody can school them picnic no more. I want to get to the style from. Eh? A tambourine with people used to plot for picnic. And leather belt. And school them properly. And you see how you grow come up nice and wonderful. And how them a brute force picnic are grow now. Disaster us. Gun rust. Internet rust. Everything that is bad in a yai. I don't know why people school them picnic. I don't know. Daddy, when you picnic them, I get out of hand. We don't need to acknowledge what Jamaica is from what we run it to. Remember the days of Jamaica was natural culture. No, no natural culture, no, they again. Because being nastiness and more sound of government implementing it. Because sound of get paid, brother. So nobody come see me at school, my picnic, and I'm not going to beat my picnic for kill him, you know. Okay. Oh, me now go beat him for kill him. Oh, when him go to school and disobey the teacher, and them call I fought, and I go slap him. And that will not run from, and that's why so much crime and violence in the country. Alright, so, you hear the things that the man said in the video, viewers and subscribers. Now, I would like you to tell me what I think about the things that he said. See? Yeah, some comments on social media gave me the understanding that some persons agree with the things that the man said and there are some persons who do not agree with the things that the man said in the video. So basically the video has been talked about on social media and I would like you my viewers and subscribers to tell me what I think about the things that the person said in that video. You can tell me if you agree or if you disagree with the things that he said. See? Now I want to say this to each and everyone before I move on to another topic. Yes, it is good to teach your child or children right from wrong. And it is good to raise your child or bring your child up in the right path of life. However, I want to encourage each and everyone to do so the legal way. Alright? Don't do anything to hurt your child. Now, before I move on to the topic that I really want to talk to you about, I'm going to talk to you about a video that I've been recorded within a country that is known as Guyana. And I would like to encourage each and everyone who are new to my channel to click the subscribe button and click the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I post a video. And if you really and truly like how I do my videos, viewers and subscribers, just leave a comment or comments to let me know. Alright? Now, there's a video circulating on social media that shows a man and a police officer from within the country of Guyana fighting with each other. Now, viewers and subscribers, I read more than one news articles about that video and the situation that gave me the understanding that those news articles said that the man who was fighting with the police officer is a minibus driver and that the man was arrested by police within the country of Guyana. Now, according to those news articles that I read, viewers and subscribers, I got the understanding that those news articles said that 
the police officer stopped the person who is said to be a minibus driver because he was speeding or for speeding and that the police asked the man to produce his license so according to those news articles that i read during subscribers it is said that while the police officer was in the process of writing the driver a ticket allegedly the driver attempted to take away his license from the police officer so it is said that uh, the driver then at some point became aggressive and it is said that uh, the driver assaulted the police officer viewing subscribers in please bear in mind that i'm going by those news articles that i read now i saw a video that shows when the police officer and the man was somewhat fighting with each other viewers and subscribers and the video that i saw shows two police officers from within the country of guyana see now i don't know if there are more videos out there viewers and subscribers but i'm just telling you about the video that i saw and in my point of view a part of the video shows when the police officer and the man was uh, on the ground while they were fighting see now based on those news articles that i read i got the understanding that those news articles said that another police officer responded to the situation and the man subsequently had been arrested and taken into police custody pending charges see but anyways i want you to please bear in mind that all those information that i gave to you are based on news articles that i read about the situation see yeah please bear in mind that all those information that i gave to you are based on news articles that i read about the situation and i hope that this video is a somewhat informative all right so you can let me know what i think about that situation viewers and subscribers i'm going to move on to the topic that i really want to talk to you about now someone contacted me dancer skill and told me that uh, him born in guyana and that guyana is not a real place and then the person went on to tell me about uh, something that he said happened within the country of guyana now viewers and subscribers me is the kind of person you know say my life will do my research when I get certain type of information. So I do my research. And believe me, I read more than one news articles about a situation where it is said that a man had been arrested and charged for stealing valuables from an airplane at an airport that is located within a country that is known as Guyana. Now, I also got information that other persons was somewhat considered as a suspect when it comes down to this whole thing you know but based on those news articles that i read it is said that the man admitted to the crime yes what i say and that the man had been arrested had been charged and had been sentenced for the crime now based on those news articles that i read viewers and subscribers i started to wonder what kind of security they had at the airport there you see me I mean, I said this to be disrespectful in no way. You see me, but me really and truly I wonder because those information that I got from those news articles that I read might be somewhat surprising to some of you, my viewers and subscribers. That's if you might have never hear about the situation. I don't have any knowledge about the situation. See? So I read a news article that gave me the understanding that a man from within the country of Ghana admitted to stealing a number of valuables from a airplane at the Chedi Jagan International Airport that is located within the country of Guyana. The picture that you're looking at on your screen viewers and subscribers had been posted different different places online claiming to show the man who had been arrested and charged and also sentenced when it comes down to this whole situation. And according to those news articles that I read and a news report that I saw, it is said that the incident happened within the month of October, the year 2022. See? Now listen. More than one news article that I read said that the man dug a hole under the fence of the perimeter of the airport and made his way onto the airport tarmac. The man somehow got inside of an aircraft and stole gadgets and beverages there might be more to the whole situation as well 
Now those news articles that I read said that the airplane land in Guyana on a certain day and that the aircraft was parked at a certain location at the airport viewers and subscribers that's the CJIA so it is said that sometime after not on the same day when the aircraft was parked but sometime after pilots return and somehow it had been realized that the aircraft had been breached and at some point the necessary authorities had been notified about the situation and at some point the man had been taken into police custody viewers and subscribers eh? yeah it is said that investigators investigated and do the necessary works and then at some point the man had been taken into police custody and sometime after that the man admitted to doing certain things and the man also had been charged now when it comes down to the sentence that those news articles said that the man got viewers and subscribers you can ask me certain questions in the comment section of this video i will tell you the information that i got see yeah so it is said that the man admitted to certain things viewers and subscribers he had been charged and he had been sentenced all right now it is also believed that the same man might have stole other things from at least one other location of viewers and subscribers it is believed so see because it is said that police also conducted a search of that person's house and they found most of the stolen items he took so one of the news article them that i read said that the man took the police to another location where the other items were located the thing about it though viewers and subscribers will really and truly have me thinking is how much time that man did really and truly have without being noticed digging a hole under a fence yeah me i wonder how much time that the man they really and truly did they have see i mean that's an airport no viewers and subscribers and i don't think i really need to point out certain things when me done said that's an airport you see yeah so big up to all of my viewers and subscribers within the country that is known as Guyana. big up to all of my viewers and subscribers within Trinidad and Tobago big up my Caribbean people eh? you see me I say yeah man worldwide they don't know a thing already I respect each and every one worldwide so big up to all right so here's where I'm going to leave it viewers and subscribers big up and respect to each and every one until next time my name is Dancer Skiller big up hey my youth you know where I watch Dancer Skiller